today's morning minute power power which is more powerful a gun in in your hand or the divine power of god living in you through the divine power of the holy spirit a gun can kill and take life however a gun cannot give life forgive sin or transform a life which is more powerful having the ability to give life or take life. And we read in Philippians 4, chapter 4, verse 13, I can do all things through Christ, which strengthens me. And then we read in 2 Corinthians chapter 10, verse 4, the weapons, the weapons we fight with are not the weapons of the world. On the contrary, they are divine power to demolish strongholds. And we read also in, in Ephesians chapter 1, verses 18 through 20, put, put your name in the blanks. And this is a prayer that Paul prayed. I pray also that the eyes of, in this case, Glenn's heart may be enlightened in order that Glenn, and put your name, may know the hope to which he or she was called called you the riches of his glorious inheritance to the state to the saint to saint glenn and his incomparable in, incomparable great power for glenn who believes that power is like the working of his mighty strength which ex, which he exerted in christ when he raised him christ from the dead and seated him at his right hand in the heavenly realms boy that's power Paul's prayer for you is that you would know the power of God which is in you. This is the same resurrection power which raised Jesus from the dead. This is the same power which allows you to forgive others and forget their trespasses against you. It's the same power which keeps you on course to never give up in your mission as an ambassador of God in the ministry of reconciliation and the power of the Holy Spirit through the blood of Jesus Christ. The Holy Spirit in you is divine power to break addictions, release light where there's darkness, speak truth where there are lies, bring abundance where there's lack, bring hope where there's a mountain of re resentment and hurt, bring forgiveness where there's brokenness, bring peace where there's anxiety, bring contentment where there's strife, and bring joy where there's pain. Even with a gun in his hand, man's power is limited and temporal, while God's divine power is eternal. Greater is he, the divine power of God, who is in you than he, the gun, who's in the world. God's almighty divine occupy love power is greater than anything the world has to offer. Walk, walk, knowing that the Holy Spirit the divine power of God, God's divine love, agape love is living in you today. Amen and amen.